Welcome to this demonstration of FCNVMe with vSphere 7. Through the support for NVMe over fiber channel with ESXi 7, it is now ready for the enterprise. And I will show you in this demonstration how easy it is to migrate your VMs from using SCSI to NVMe. Let's first take a look at the environment. Here I, on my ESX server, you can see I have a data store called NVMe 200. I simply provisioned an NVMe namespace on the storage array and created the data store. The host already had a SCSI LUN backed data store called FCP 200. And before we do anything further, let's just take a look at the SAN fabric. You can see here in SAN nav, I have a Gen 7 fabric with two G720 switches. The host is connected also with a Gen 7 Emulex adapter and the storage array is connected with two ports. All ports in the environment transports both NVMe and SCSI concurrently. Now let's go back and take a look at the host and the VM. So you see here, I select my Windows VM. I have traffic running on it. You can see over on the right hand side, a 7030 workload. And now I'm gonna do a storage remotion from of the virtual disk from the FCP data store to the NVMe data store. It is a simple standard storage vMotion that I'm doing here. But what I want you to do is keep an eye on the performance of the storage uh, workload on the right. So you can see initially there's a little bit of a dip in the performance as there always is when you do a storage vMotion. And then right after that, we're running close to two times the performance uh, just because we moved to NVMe instead of using SCSI on the same array, same host, same everything. I want to emphasize that I didn't do anything to optimize this demonstration for performance. I simply used the built-in drivers from Emulex for the HBA and provisioned the NVMe namespace on the array. Now, having that said, ECD, which is the Emulex division of Broadcom, they did a Tali test report back in April where they proved that with both Microsoft SQL Server and Oracle, they're able to get more than 2x the performance using exactly the same hardware, exactly the same uh, storage array, simply by moving to NVMe instead of SCSI. I'm going to go back in here to SANNAV and just show you that I moved the VDisk back and forth a couple of times, simply to illustrate that what we saw is completely repeatable and very consistent. You can see the blue line here is for read and the black line is for write. And you can see when I run with NVMe versus SCSI, the performance is close to 2x. So just to recap, NVMe is ready for the enterprise. You can migrate your VMs from SCSI to NVMe at your own pace using your existing infrastructure on either Gen 5, Gen 6, or Gen 7 fabrics. Thanks a lot for watching. For more information, please go to broadcom.com. Thank you.